Hello, everybody, and welcome to Denton, Texas, in the Mean Green Volleyball Center. Well, it's been a long time in the making because we, you know, we've had the graduations and and so forth, and just trying to blend in new players and freshmen. And so, uh, it, I think this year is a culmination of what we've been trying to do as a staff over the last several years and, and the girls have responded this year. Um, going in, I think we knew our goals as a team and um, I feel like we prepared for this, we worked hard for this and so going in I was more determined than ever to not only have a good season, first season, but also for the seniors leaving. Um, I actually did think we would be here because we worked very hard in the summer. We put in a lot of hours, a lot of time in the gym and a lot of time bonding off the court as well. So. We knew we would have a tight-knit group and we knew we would dominate on the court because we had a lot of good talent coming in. In the summer, we put in a lot of hours and on and off the court, getting to know each other a little bit more, especially the freshmen, and kind of just finding out how to work together and be more cohesive on the court. Henner getting it to York, who's a rare spike for Carly York. You know, I thought we had a pretty good talented team last year as well, um, but our off, some of our off the court um, chemistry just wasn't there and I think that's what hurt us the most last year and I, this year we're more experienced. Um, the game has slowed down a little bit for some of our older players which makes it a lot easier for them to play. We all know our roles on the team like what they're going to bring whether it's serving or cheering or whatever everyone's accepted their roles and ready to give to the team what they can. Well the first big swing you see of the entire Rally was Valerian for the you know, Freshmen have made a really big impact. Um, when they first came in, our coach didn't want us to really overpower them with the systems and just like little fundamental things. He wanted them to just get in there and play volleyball because when you get bogged down with all these like technical things, like you really start to lose your little edge on everybody. There's been a lot of struggles. There will continue to be struggles and there will continue to be learning moments for the freshmen. They're doing a good job for the moments that I need them to uh, be better at, and, but they still have a lot to learn as far as system-wise. I will say definitely coming in the spring really helped me a lot. Um, being able to uh, learn the plays, learn um, the different adjustments of what I can do to prepare for conference seasons. I'm really happy with how we've been doing. You know, teams are coming after them and they've held themselves uh, up pretty well. This group has not won together as much as we're winning now. And sometimes when you're winning as much as we're winning, uh, complacency sets in. And so I want to make sure as a coach and coaching staff that we're not allowing our players to do that. He really heavily enforces uh, uh, player accountability. And, and so I feel like that's really helped us on the court to not remain complacent and keep on being determined. Obviously, we haven't earned a championship yet or like that's just not going to be given to us. So making sure that we keep our energy and our work ethic and everything that we've been working on in practice the same. And there's always things that we have to uh, get better at, but, um, and so we're, 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 I think we're in a good place right now as far as both mentally and physically. And North Texas with the kill, Tico puts it away, and the Mean Green on the road win in straight sets over Mississippi State. We had to prove that we aren't the same team as last year. We're different and we've come to play and we've come to win. I think there's always going to be pressure because since we have come out and done so good this year, everyone's kind of gunning towards us. Everyone wants to play their best match against us, but we know that if we just play consistent and we play our game and how we know, the win just comes with it. Because we're, we're a younger team, we have, to, we have to make sure that we always uh, stay focused on what we're doing every single day and every single uh, point. I think that the atmosphere here has helped with this North Texas team. Just being able to go on the court every day, not only for ourselves, for our coaches, but for our fans really is a, makes me proud to be a UNT volleyball player. Uh, we just want them to keep uh, supporting us and keep riding with us because their energy, feed, we feed off of their energy. So when they're in here loud, screaming, Yelling at the other team, uh, that really pumps us up. It's incredible. It's, um, it's almost like a different experience because it just brings so much more energy and excitement to the team because we also had a ton of little girls here. We had a ton of parents and friends. So like you want to show up not only for your team, but for them. You know, whenever you're running a program and you're, you're, you're wanting to win, you're not only wanting to win for volleyball or for your players, but you want the whole 
university to be proud of what you're doing and I think hopefully it's coming across that way that they're that they have a team that they can cheer for but they have a team that they can cheer for because of the way we play we want our the community to just admire us because of the way we play not just because of our wins and losses and hopefully as a result of that we win matches and I think that's what's happened this year North Texas with a three set sweep of the visiting Oklahoma Sooners the mean green have Oklahoma.